Good evening, I'm Anna Manuel. The Wesley House Community Center bringing people together today to pray for the city and the lives that were affected by recent shootings. Twin States News' Jasmine Stevenson was there to capture the moments. Executive Director of the Wesley House Community Center, Reverend David Schultz, held the prayer event to ensure people will have a place to come together during these times. Being the Wesley House Community Center, it's an important thing for us to be there for the community or for the com a place that the community can come together when they're hurting. And uh, in this case, with the shooting of Officer Croom, it, it, I think many of us are hurting. Janelle Miller lost her husband in the Lockheed shooting in 2003. Miller says incidents like the recent shootings oftentimes make her relive those moments. I felt it, you know, when something happened and you feel it, I'm experiencing it again somewhat. And I know what brought me through. And that was my hope and my faith in God that brought me through. So I came out to share that with the community that we can you know, get a hold and get a grip on this thing and and be able to live in peace. Several pastors were in attendance. Pastor Marjorie Walker believes that through unity, peace will be found. I think it is absolutely very significant, very important that we uh, demonstrate love in the community and this is one definitely way to do that when you when we are gathered as a community and because in community there is unity. And so here we are as a community praying for peace together. And when we do things together, it makes us stronger. Jasmine Stevenson, Twin States News, Meridian.